seven locomotive. With lumber, yes, with lumber for Uncle Digger's cabin is heading down to Denver. And it's Hello, guys. Swing under Denver's Union Station, come back out, and we'll be heading west back into Arvada, and we're gonna park and unload the this lumber at Jerry Sat's mill for Uncle Digger's Uncle Digger's new cabin and then we'll be heading back up to pick up more Welcome. Welcome to the Iron Horse Route, home of the Denver and Rio Grande Western. This is Brian. I'm glad you're here. And if you're not already a subscriber, I want to encourage you to subscribe. Because when you're a subscriber here, you get access to a lot of great model railroad video uploads. And so now that you're subscribed, we invite you to sit back, relax, and enjoy today's video upload, which is coming up right now. Let's get her ready to Okay, everybody, we got the F7 here with empty coal cars, and AJ was just driving the train around, and she had an idea. She said, I want to stop and pick up some sticks, and I said, okay, so then she stopped, and we pulled the uh, empty coal pieces out so she could load in here, and then she said, and then why don't we take them down here and drop them off and i said okay that's a good idea she <laughs> said yeah then we can go around and we'll have to come back she says because we're gonna have to pick up the rest of the sticks to get them down here y'all this is all her idea I promise she did all this i didn't say any of this to her all right so she wants to do what she wants to do is move all the logs from McKernan's in the empty coal cars down to Jerry Sat's mill for one reason or another, but we don't really necessarily need a reason yet, or we might come up with one. But we basically uh, come up with... Because they're, they're trying to build a new house. Oh, for a new house down here that's going to be built. You know what? They're doing it for Uncle Digger's new cabin that's being built now that I think about it. That's what's going on, everybody. All right, so AJ is driving the train. Forgive that. Okay, <laughs> so AJ is driving the train and loading uh, these logs into an, the empty coal cars from McKernan's because they're going to be used down here by Jerry Sat's mill. All right, so the first load of lumber has been dropped off for Uncle Digger's cabin. Uncle Digger's cabin is gonna go right here. He's gonna be pretty close to Jerry Sat's. Jerry Sat's has been nice enough to allow Digger to drop one of his loads of lumber off in his driveway. Um, Digger's gonna have a few loads of lumber coming in for his cabin and AJ's getting ready to drive the train back up to McKernan's Mill and we're gonna swing around at McKernan's okay. Mill and reload the front three cars again with all the lumber they can hold and we'll be right back down. And the train's pulling out of here. Heading for McKernan's Mill to get more lumber. And so we won't be going all the way up to Winter Park. We'll just be going to the Gross Reservoir to McKernan's to get more lumber. We're doing a turnaround and backing in refilling coming back down and dropping off load number two
stop her, AJ. Good job. And we flip the switch. Back her up, AJ. Load number two has been loaded up, and looks like we just got one little load after this, and we'll be ready to get Uncle Digger's cabin built. There's Uncle Mark's cabin right there, Uncle John's cabin right there. All right, AJ, be ready when you are. Heading back down to Arvada. Want to get a good running start at it, huh? There we go, heading to Denver. Eastbound from the Gross Reservoir. Heading down to Denver. Hey, we decided to put the house right in that, right in that brown That's right. You gotta get ready to stop it there, conductor. <laughs> Westbound now back to Arvada and we're gonna stop and drop off load number two and we'll come back to you in just a moment. Hey Jay's getting us out of here. Go pick up load three so we can have some dinner. Alright everybody, we have dropped off the second load right down here. This is where Uncle Digger's cabin is gonna be built again. Uh, Uncle Jerry over there was kind enough to let Digger drop one of his lumber loads off in his driveway. And now, AJ, uh, the conductor, has got to drive back up to the Gross Reservoir for one final load. And then we'll be ready to assemble Uncle Digger's cabin over here and get Uncle Digger a place to stay. That train might be... Yeah, that train might be tired from doing that. Yeah, she said the train might be tired. So last load of the day. It's not that far of a trip from Arvada to the Gross Reservoir. Get us out of here, AJ. Seven heading back to McKernan's Mill for lumber load number three. It's slowing down because it's going uphill. told you too soon. Backing in to pick up the third and final load of Uncle Digger's lumber from Uncle John's mill. All right, everybody, the third and final load has been loaded up and AJ's gonna get out of here and head down to Jerry Satt's mill with the third and final load. We can get Uncle Digger's cabin built. <laughs> Stop it. Coming out of Union Station, now westbound again for the third time into Arvada. Stopping, gonna drop off the third and final load of Uncle Digger's lumber. We'll get his cabin built this later this week into next weekend and get him a place to stay. 
And getting out of here, it is evening time, going on night, and we're going to head back up to the Brace Reservoir, do a turnaround at McKernan's Mill, and then we're going to back in and drop off Uncle Roy's coal cars that he loaned to us for the logs. And then we're going to have dinner at noon. Get to there all the way and over there. 